Mr. President, distinguished members of the Human Rights Council, Excellencies and colleagues, thank you for the opportunity to address you. In Iraq, human rights are under assault from a new wave of violence. The resurgence in the indiscriminate sectarian targeting of civilians is deeply alarming. This is not only because of the soaring number of killings, with more than 1,800 recorded deaths in the past two months alone, and accompanying suffering, but also because of the impunity and lack of accountability for the perpetrators and the difficult challenges it poses to human rights and the rule of law institutions. I call on the authorities to do the utmost to protect all people in Iraq and urge it to ensure the investigation it has announced into the recent deplorable killing of at least 52 people in Camp Ashraf, that it is fully independent, thorough, and transparent. The authorities must take extra steps to guarantee the protection of the residents in both Camp Ashraf and Camp Liberty. Iraq has not yet responded to UN and international calls for a moratorium on the death penalty and continues to periodically execute people in batches. A total of 123 prisoners were executed in 2012 and another 75 so far in 2013, despite the immense risk of miscarriage of justice as a result of systemic weaknesses in the criminal justice system.